Okay. Uh, if you want a number, and I love this, you got to earn it. The reason we're here is because we ask you for the numbers that you desire, and a lot of you guys was desiring numbers that ain't you. What I mean by that, uh, alignment is not wearing a single digit. That's not going to happen up under me. That's not going to happen. And if you ain't that guy, you're not wearing a single digit. Back in the day, when uh, we came up, the single digits was that guy, right? It was him. It, it, was, it was who he was. How can you act the number one and you ain't the one? Okay? And second of all, ain't nobody going to wear the number of the quarterback. I don't care if it's my son. I don't care who it is. Whoever the starting quarterback is, nobody's wearing a duplicate number. That don't happen nowhere. It's not going to happen here. Uh, we only have eight single digits because two is gone, and I give out one. So there's only eight left. You're not wearing zero. That would never happen because that means you're nothing. So that's, I don't understand who wants a zero. I don't understand if you want to be a nothing. I don't, I don't get that. So, uh, so there's eight, seven of those numbers, and we will assign those. Or you work your butt off, we get it. But we get one, we get zero, we get two. So you do the mathematics and, and see what's left. You earn it. For example, if this guy wants this number, then what number you have? Who else wants 45? That means you got to be better than him. That's simple. Okay? You better than him, you get the number. Give me another example. Uh, Stella, what you want? 17. Who else wants 17? Anybody? Nobody? Okay, that means you'll most likely get 17. But guess what? We got a new group of guys coming right after spring. You have to fight for it again. We got that? That's how we're going to do the numbers. Now, what's going to happen with the numbers, the coach is going to bring you guys at the end of every week. They don't have to give out a number. Like, you don't have to go through the Hall of Fame. That's a, every week it's going to be judged. If you're balling out, coach may say, uh, shoot, I got a line when coach is kicking butt. Look at the dirt. I said, let's see the tape. Let me see the tape. Are you kicking butt? We're going to say, yeah. He gets his number at the end of the week. So when he comes back to practice on that Monday after the break, when we come back after spring break, he's going to have his number. We good? Yes, sir. Everything you do around here will be earned. We ain't giving you nothing. So you got to go get it, and you got to take it. We understand that. Yes, sir. Coach Primer said no numbers on jerseys yet. They had to be earned. Yes, What's sir? that mean to you to have to earn that? It means you've got to be nameless, faceless, and great before you get any sort of recognition, which uh, I 100% believe in. And how do you think that helps impact the team? I think keeping numbers off keeps it more about the team and less about the individual and lets you get recognized as an individual once you compete for the team. Now, were you on the squad last year? Yes, I was. All right, so let's talk about that. Talk about uh, some of the changes that you see going to this first day of practice compared to the program before. Yes, sir. I see a lot more excitement, a lot more energy, a lot more guys that seem to have bought in and uh, overall, just a lot more passion. It's, uh, it's a great feeling. So, so Coach Prime has said no numbers yet. Everything has to be learned. Got to compete for it. Mm -hmm. What's your thoughts on that? It's something I believe in. Like You definitely got to earn everything you do or get, especially here. I like that that's his philosophy, and I feel like, you know, it ain't nothing to just earn a, a number. You got to go out there and put the work in for real. You know, they say from day one competing, this is day one. What are you looking forward to? Um, I feel like I've been competing since I got here, for real. But I'm most looking forward to, like, actually blocking somebody now with, like, gloves, pads, we got helmets. So I'm ready to get to the real football. We coming. Yes, sir. Coach Prime talked about the need for players to earn their numbers. What does that mean to you? It means 43 is not guaranteed. You might not even come back, to be honest with you. Um, but I talked to the guy that wore number 43 last year, so I'm gonna just give it to him because it, it means something to him. So, but yeah, I, the numbers that I chose, a lot of people chose them, so I know I'm gonna have to compete for it. Well, we'll just talk about that for a second, that, that everybody has to earn their number. Nobody is out here today with numbers on because it hasn't been earned yet. Correct. Um, well, there's, I don't know if you can see, but there's no numbers on anybody's jerseys, not Shadour's, Travis, nobody. So that's telling me that I gotta be able to compete against other guys in the team to make sure that I get the number that I want. Coach Prime has said no numbers yet. Got to compete for everything. This is day one. What are your thoughts on that? Uh, just got to compete. I mean, there really nothing else to it. You don't want to go through life and whatever. 
you don't want to go through life with everything given to you. I mean, it's, it's worth something if you really work for it, you know? So Coach Primer said no numbers yet. They had to be earned. What's your thoughts? I mean, everything around here is earned. I mean, at Jackson State, it was the same thing. Here's going to be the same thing. Everything's earned, not given. So we just got to work one day at a time. What's your thoughts on having to compete for that number, Wells? That's what I've been doing. We always going to compete every day. Man, it is what it is, you know. I'm always going to compete. It is what it is. I'm number 70 this year. I'm number 70. I mean, you don't get paid to just show up. You got paid to get work, you know. You get your numbers, you get work. You get paid, you work. You look good, you feel good. You feel good, you play good. You play good, they pay good. There's another reason to work hard. There's another reason to work hard. I just said uh, so coaches mandated no numbers yet that the players got to earn it. Yes, sir. What do you think? It's unbelievable, man. Like that, we were talking about that. Matter of fact, I talked to one of the uh, recruits' parents the other day, and he was asking about that. And I explained, I don't know 100%, but you know, from my conversations with Coach Prime, that's pressure. Everything is earned, not given. And I think that resonated with that parent. So I'm all in, man. It's going to be tough for us to execute, but that's what we're here for. Now this ain't your first spring in Colorado. What are some of the differences did you see? Uh, under Coach Prime for this day one as we get ready to get going. A lot of detail, um, a lot of uh, a lot of effort spent to make sure no time is wasted. We're perfect from minute one to get everything that we can out of these players to make sure they have the best chance for success. It's unbelievable. The, the energy that's in the air around here is, uh, I've not felt that energy since, uh, and I'm old like you, Neely, but I haven't felt that energy since uh, uh, in the 90s when we were uh, we had some Warriors on this team, so I'm pretty excited. And uh, 1990 is a national championship. Yes, sir. I still got the ring, man.